September 7th. Of course, yes. the Zeb spectacular Judah. return. First round knockout yeah. Zeb Judah. of Edwin Vasquez. Vasquez. Yes. So, Judah first fight back since Cotto, of course, very shortly after it. Uh, less than three months, actually. Definitely no more than three rounds. No, this fight no will way. Be. No way. At the absolute most. That's if Judah comes out cautious. <laughs> yeah. That's if he tries to get rounds in. And I don't think he's going to try to get rounds he's, in. He's looking to get back in the title picture yeah, right away. get an impressive win. He's looking to knock the living hell out of Vasquez. Vasquez to be back in the ring this soon after yeah. the other fight. This isn't going to be... After the worst beating of his career and after the worst fight of his career. So This isn't going to be the... Um, what were a couple of those fights that they claimed he struggled his ass off? Uh, in? Pineda. Pineda. Yeah, this isn't going to be clearly Pineda. Beat. Yeah. So. Um, this isn't going to be like uh, who was it? The the. the Baltimore. Yeah. Which he did beat, but they robbed him. But, but um. Won't be like that at all. This will be like the uh, Wayne Martell and. Uh, but this this is going to be the highest level of Friday night fight fighters. Uh, Friday night fighters that you've seen in a while, because not only do we have Zab Judah, we got Junior Winner versus Vivian yes, Harris. on Friday. Yeah. On a Friday. Yeah, unbelievable. Don't know why, but anyhow it is, and we probably won't be seeing it live, because still as of now, there's no U.S. TV for it. Nope. So um, we'll get a link. Someone send us... Um, can't wait for Live that. Link and that. let's make a pick on I'm, the... Yeah, yep, you're going with Witter. I'm, I originally said Harris. I've seen a few Witter fights now, about four or five. Uh, I'm going to have to change my pick. Oh. Yeah. You are picking. Yeah, absolutely. I, I thought you were going to stick no, with Harris. No, I won't stick with Harris. Witter, just too skilled, too fast. Um, Very good switch hitter. Yeah, and he's... Powerful, and Harris got a questionable chin. The, guess, the funny so. thing about Witter... That the Hatton fans like to say. They say he's very overrated. No, very underrated, definitely. Hatton fans. Hatton fans, that's like... Uh, that's, uh, but The person you're a fan of is the one that's overrated. But, uh... <laughs> indeed. But, uh, not that Hatton sucks. No. We're not saying that, no, so... But he is overrated. By you. Mm -hmm. um, junior Witter would beat him. Yeah, definitely. I, I mean, would pick Witter to beat him. Um, Hatton has publicly ducked Witter. He's publicly ducked several. Yeah, publicly duck, ducked Mayweather up until now. Well, he never said, I won't fight them, but he yeah, certainly... Yeah. But yes, he you did. You could tell by the negotiations. The way things went, he could have at least said, I will fight him, and by not saying that... Yeah. He obviously didn't want to fight them. Undeniable. So. You can try, and that's not even saying he wouldn't be willing to now because, yeah, he's going to fight Mayweather. Yeah. That doesn't change history. Yeah. At then, one point, he ducked people. Mm hmm That doesn't... So, people, people like to say once a guy finally fights somebody, gets some yeah. balls and fights somebody. Okay, yeah. He gets credit for that, definitely, for finally stepping up. But that doesn't erase what's happened in the past at all. Nope. Of him Never. ducking other fighters. No matter who it is. Or for him ducking that same fighter for that long. Gaddy, Gaddy finally got in the ring with Mayweather after two years of Mayweather calling him out. That doesn't, Freitas? Yeah, that doesn't excuse the two years that Absolutely Gaddy ducked Freitas him. Freitas with Casamayor. Yeah, which, well, he never got back in the ring with him. No, never yeah. got back. <laughs> But and the first book leading up to it. And Zoo, of course, Zizou never costumes getting Zizou back in the ring with Judah. Yeah. And, and it, it took him it took him three times to get that fight done mm -hmm. before it finally happened. Because yep. he kept pulling out when he fought when he had had more fights in Judah and had been fighting longer. And he claimed he needed more tune ups and more experience. So. And so far Maskaev has not gotten in the ring with Peter. Peter. Yeah. But Tally Klitschko. Yes. Ran out of boxing to <coughs> avoid seeing Raman. Yeah. Whether you think Raman sucks completely yeah. or not, it doesn't change the fact that Vitaly ducked, ducked him. And pulled out four separate times. He must... He, well, then a shitty fighter uh, scared Vitaly Klitschko out of boxing for a while. Yeah. And now he's back. <laughs> <coughs> and he's... And who was he trying to get a fight with so diehard? Not 
saying, let me fight Samuel Peter. Oh, yeah. yeah. No, or let me wait for Samuel uh -huh. Peter to beat the living shit out of Olaf. Oh, or let me wait for this fight, and, exactly you know, Maskev could win, whatever, not, not likely, but, you yeah, know, he could. I'd fight the winner, that's what he could have said. You exactly. Know. Now, it's supposed to happen that way, Yeah. but, of course, he's going to sit back and say, wait, let me see who wins this. Yeah. Oh, shit, Peter did win, just as I knew he would. Okay. And he'll either get the title stripped from Peter, and they'll hand it to him, or he'll run out of boxing again, or he'll fight somebody else that he can yeah. be. He'll, so. he'll, he'll fake an injury, <clears throat> Peter will... You get stuck having to fight Oliver McCall. That's so ridiculous. Because yes. that's the next in line after Vitaly. Yep. So Peter has his two, or the winner of that fight has his two title shot and t title defenses lined up before the fight's even over. By the WBC, Jose Suleiman, the one that they were that was so deserving uh -huh. of being put in the World Boxing Hall of Fame, International Boxing Hall of Fame. Definitely. Jose Suleiman, you know the same one. Uh, the same Hall of Fame that has recent inductees Whitaker yeah, and Duran and Lopez. Yeah. Oh yeah, Suleiman. Same. It goes along with them. Good. Good move. Yeah, definitely. We need to go to the International Boxing Hall of Fame and throw some fucking people out. He's the first one on the list. Because yeah. okay, yeah, Don King and Bob Arum. Uh, at least they've done something yeah. to contribute to the sport. They made a lot of great fights. Whether they ripped people off or not, they did something. Good. I can see. I fight. can see argument for them for yeah. non for non boxers. There's they do make it very clear that these yeah. are non boxers. Of course. Even on the website. <clears throat> but um. Bert it, Sugar's another one. He's out. I think he's, he's in it. Oh yeah, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Throw him out. Yeah, definitely. You gotta have. Okay, but um. And that stupid ass hat and cigar. <laughs> suspenders. And whatever he does. His tie. Yeah. Uh, but <coughs> uh, how? Where else were we? Where else were we going? Um, uh, we were talking about the WBC. WBC. So this. Uh, uh, so Peter Maskev. That's it. Kuchko coming back. Vitaly Kuchko. Yeah. Uh, um, and Duncan not just, wanting to fight yeah, Peter. Which, which came out from Maskev. the Junior Winner thing in Ricky okay. Hatton. Right. Right. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Quite a jump. <laughs> Anyway. All, all, all these people have something in common, though. Yeah, sure do. Klitschko and Hatton, definitely. Klitschko, Hatton, Suleiman. Yeah. All them. But, uh, yeah, Hatton um, should have fought Witter. That's undeniable. Yes. Hatton fans can say all they want that if it's not a big money fight and all that. That's, you're full of that's shit. That's bullshit. It's you're full of shit. Yeah. Wh <coughs> Junior Witter is a good <coughs> trash talker. Everyone yeah. would have loved to see to Hatton see beat him. Hatton yeah. knock the living hell out of him in Manchester. Yeah. Okay. Or happen. you could put it in your Wembley Stadium. Yeah. Um, and just no excuse, especially when Hatton was coming up. I mean, to not make this fight like a 2003. Or earlier, I mean, absolutely no. Before he then. was for, by yeah. the time he was forty and oh, Eamon yeah. McGee, yeah, They're every Shambri Mitchell opponent, yep. Uh, uh, who? Let's see, what was it? Mike Stewart was one of them. Yep. Uh, Carlos Vilches, who Mitchell knocked out in four rounds, and out. Hatton took decision after Mitchell beat him, and also Ben Tacky, of course. And Vince Phillips, there's another one. Got Mitchell's leftovers, right? One right after uh, another. Vince Phillips. <laughs> but wouldn't fight Junior Witter. But uh, apparently Vince Phillips was more deserving, I guess. Go Vince Phillips. Yeah. Should be spelled with a K instead of a C. For the and cigarettes. With that voice. Yeah. Maybe that's why. He's um, cool because he smokes. Oh, yeah. Definitely. Which you should do. Because Vince Phillips quicker. Says, yeah. Only, only the ones that don't like a show, like of course. Show. That's not many. <laughs> <laughs> no. Uh, but we, we have our fans too, and thank you all. Actually, all of them, yeah. even the haters, what are the fans. Yeah, definitely. Your viewers, your fans. Thanks for watching. Botsingforreal at gmail.com. See you.